In the last 18 months, you know, our organization, we've been driving a lot of change in this organization, and, you know, that includes the sale of the company. It includes uh, the transition to new ownership, new leadership, new priorities. And since the closing of the sale in August, I've spent a lot of time working closely with our board as they evaluated our organization and its people and the long-term direction of our teams. And so part of that assessment involved taking a look at the Maple Leafs and our hockey organization. And as a result of that, we've decided to make a leadership change and move in a different direction for the general manager role. And so with that, I'm pleased to appoint Dave Nonis, the 14th general manager in the history of the Toronto Maple Leafs. Earlier this morning, um, Brian Burke was relieved of his duties as the president and GM of the Leafs, but he will stay on as a senior advisor to myself and the board. I want to thank Brian for his tremendous commitment, dedication, and service to this organization. He's, uh, you all know him, he's a man of great passion, integrity, principles, he's a friend. He's clearly made an indelible mark on this community and our, and our hockey club. I want to thank Brian for everything he's done for this organization. I think uh, years down the road, we'll be able to look back and see the mark that he made, uh, which is significant. Uh, Second, I'd like to thank him personally for everything he's done to, done for me. I worked for Brian for most of my adult life, and uh, he's uh, always been a, a great friend and mentor. I was informed of the ownership group's decision this morning uh, after they had spoken to Brian. Um, and yes, I have had a brief conversation with Brian where, uh, again, we've go back a long way. He's pledged to help me as much as he can, as he always has. and. Uh, uh, I expect I'll talk to him again in the next day or two. Uh, we talked to Brian first thing this morning, and uh, you know his reaction was, uh, as you would expect, one of class, uh, one of disappointment, um, but one of acceptance. To either he, he understands that this is part of the game and part of the industry, and it's a it's part of the industry that none of us like. And uh, and uh, but he respected the fact that ownership gets to decide who its general manager is, and uh, and uh, he. Uh, he was quick to point out the building blocks that have been put in place, and uh, as Dave just uh, just recognized him for, and uh, and so his reaction was just one of class. You know, this isn't about me taking over the team. I, I think that's an important factor. It's it's about the management group together moving forward, and decisions are going to be made um, together, and we need to. You know, we need to continue to discuss things. We have quality people here. We have some, uh, again, veteran NHL players that play the game, that understand how to, what it takes to win. Uh, and you know, we'll be discussing how we move forward together, no question. It's, it's going to be a, a group effort, and I think most successful organizations go about it that way. Thank you.